are what I've grown up making my career out of, but they are also how we live our entire lives. And I think a lot of people don't realize the extent to which stories shape our world and our history and our learning. And that makes stories a really ideal communication tool in vaccine hesitancy because a lot of people who are frightened of vaccines or side effects, that fear has often arisen from a story they've been told. And if the fear was planted by a story, perhaps some of that fear can be alleviated by stories that convey accurate information, but are also coming from someone that they trust and a story that emotionally resonates with someone. So it's not that much different than teaching anything else. It's just, instead of throwing facts at someone, you weave those facts into a story that our brains are a lot more readily able to accept because that's how we understand our world, whether it's, it's myths or telling a joke or telling what happened when you were on vacation. Stories are the backbone of all of our communication and it just makes sense to use that tool in vaccine hesitancy as well.